certainly determined to prove a point, and that's that he should be on top. Well, he has the opportunity to prove that point tonight, for us to see if he's all involved. He has got a tall test tonight in the form of John Cena. I mean, I've lost count of how many world titles Cena has actually won. Yeah, well, you'd have to take your shoes off, Saxon, just to count the amount of world championships <laughs> big match John has captured in his career. But what really matters with Cena are the intangibles, the grit, the determination, the simple refusal to back down in the face of an opponent. Make no mistake, Byron, John Cena is one of one when it comes to WWE. And Cena finds himself on the receiving end. Oh, the reversal by Cena. Cena's been around the block a few times. He can adapt to any opponent's style. But Corey, is there anything specific you think Cena really needs to focus on here? Oh, absolutely, Cole. Cena can't let the noise get to him. I know he likes to hear what the WWE Universe has to say, but honestly, the bigger thing he needs to focus on here is getting results. Don't pander. Just do the work. Now John asserting control. And this is Cena focusing up, just doing the work and getting the results.
the only person who thinks John Cena is the greatest of all time, just in case someone here decides to be a contrarian. I see you looking at me, but I ain't gonna fight you. The mountain of world titles, the biggest run at the top of all time. God knows how many main events. If you deny Cena's greatness at this point, you're a fool. And I am no fool. Mark it down, Byron. That's how you get Corey to agree with him. But he'll be taking on an individual who is turning a lot of heads as of late. He's gained a level of popularity that is steadily growing week by week. And he wants to prove that the hype is legitimate. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. He gets back into the ring. What's coming next? Back suplex. This is just ridiculous. Look at the power. This is downright superhuman. Downright gut-wrenched suplex. The force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. Ah, look at this. Just cranking it out. Just cranking the head. Elbow drop. Piercing. from this superstar tonight, guys. Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility that we've never seen before. Yeah, he also said he's going to make the competition bank for mercy. And he's matched up with John Cena, someone who really practices what he preaches with the phrase, never give up. In a final big match, John Cena takes a night off. Cena's calling cards are grit and determination, and he's been throwing them down for taking flight. for a pin so soon. And he's taking this to the outside now. Boom! Michinoku driver. This match grinded him down a little. No need to Whoa. panic. He's still swinging. <laughs> Cranking the head. John Cena is known for his big heart outside of the ring. Is that something that translates inside the ring as well? Absolutely, Cole. Putting his heart into everything he does is what made John Cena so successful in and out of the ring. I don't think tonight will be any different. And set right into the corner. Oh, he retaliates. Able to avoid any harm there. Cena got 
caught with a reversal. And now thrown back into the ring. This is just brute power. What a German suplex. superstar a bit too intense and as we can already see from the look in his eyes there's a reason why in this business intensity often breeds success and he is well aware he's hoping that five since what really propelled him to success but don't even think about counting out big match jump
Pearson. He's finding himself in trouble here. I don't want to say he's done, but I can hear the fat lady warming up. Cena thinking about ending this. STF is in. STF is in. John Cena, the patented STF. He's tapped many men out in his career with this move. Whoa, wait a second. You can't see him, but you 